Well, court is now adjourned for the day in the historic criminal case against former President Donald Trump. He faces 34 felony charges amid accusations that he falsified business records to cover up an alleged affair with adult film star Stormy Daniels. WCNC Charlotte's anchor Nick Sturdivant has been following this case closely. Nick, we know a key witness was on the stand today. Hey guys, yeah, that's right. Former National Enquirer publisher David Pecker taking the stand again. Now, Pecker is allegedly at the heart of the catch and kill scheme to silence the stories of people like Stormy Daniels before the 2016 election. Prosecutors say he made this plan at a Trump Tower meeting back in 2015 with the former president and his former personal lawyer, Michael Cohen. On the stand, Pecker testified that he got a phone call from Cohen that uh, that year stating, quote, the boss wanted to see him. It was there. He agreed to help Trump. After that, Pecker says he met with former National Enquirer editor in chief Dylan Howard. He told him that any stories that came in uh, came in about Trump or the election must be vetted and brought straight to him and Cohen. Before testimony got underway, the judge held a contempt hearing on Trump's alleged violations of the limited gag order in this case. It prohibits statements about witnesses, jurors, and lawyers. Prosecutors argue Trump violated that order on at least 10 separate occasions this month. I'd love to talk to you people. I'd love to say everything that's on my mind, but I'm restricted because I have a gag order. And I'm not sure that anybody's ever seen anything like this before. And you guys, Pecker will resume his testimony on Thursday. We'll continue to follow this uh, case and on the latest of this case and keep you updated on air and online. All right, Nick, thank you.